Okay, let's just, just, let's just pump the brakes quickly, okay? Uh, I, I think we, we, we're kind of getting a bit off track. I want us to understand exactly what the question was, all right? Let's just ask the question, and then we'll come back to, to what this is, because I, I think that our listeners out there, I think it's important for us to leave them with something that's of value. The question that I asked was, in a world filled with noise and distraction, how do you personally discern truth from falsehood exactly my point and and that and let me answer that question for you okay etienne i rely on my critical thinking skills and research to separate the truth from fiction you see yes but by uh, questioning sources and verifying information i can find the truth Amidst all of the noise, and all of this noise that's happening here is just another reason why the Crown should be involved. So I'm not sure what, what my learned friend over here has in that cup, if it is actually tea uh, or if it's herbal, if you catch my drift. Uh, but let me, let me explain to you what my position is. All right now, this is exactly why I believe in seeking diverse perspectives and cross-referencing information to uncover the truth. By standing curious and open-minded, I can navigate through all the types of distractions, including the kinds of things that have happened and led us to this situation right now. And yet again, comrades, this is exactly the reason why we have come to the table and we are able to provide a little bit more perspective. And in, in our country, and if I may be so bold, they will say that we rather ask more of the questions. What if the distinction between truth and falsehood isn't always clear-cut? Just like in this room right now, we're not too sure who is who and what is what. Perhaps truth is a journey rather than a destination. By embracing uncertainties and staying open to new insights we can continually refine our understanding of the truth and by doing this we're able to move forward progress and uh, long live mother russia so uh, all i'll say is i'm grateful that we've at least gotten to a point where we could give each other an opportunity to speak and i am very curious to find out what our audience thinks because the truth is what we're after and that's all we need <laughs>